the chance to talk to the car company tonight. They aren't talking about any specifics of where these cars are stashed around the country. I can tell you, of course, the Pontiac Silverdome is one of those. Hundreds of thousands of cars across the country are put at these locations. We aren't being told why, but it's hard to see back behind me. But back there in the dark, there are rows and rows of these Volkswagens. I'm talking about a thousand or so. Like you said, this all started probably late November, part of the buyback program, and no one knows how long they will be out here. The Silver Dome parking lot now covered with hundreds and hundreds of Volkswagen TDIs. 7 Action News has learned there are several locations around the country where these cars are stashed for the time being. The car company stopped selling these cars and started buying them back after hundreds of thousands were affected by the emission scandal. After reaching out to Volkswagen today, it told us, quote, once a buyback transaction is complete, Volkswagen will remove the vehicle from the dealership and store it at a regional facility. These vehicles will be held and routinely maintained until it is determined whether an approved emissions modification becomes available. So for now, this area is storage until further notice. As you heard the company say right there, right now they are waiting for any, uh, any approval for some modifications. And if that doesn't happen for some of these vehicles out here, the hundreds of vehicles, then they tell me they will be recycled. For now, we're live in Pontiac, Aaron Baskerville, 7 Action News. Yeah, it seems like such a waste there just to recycle those vehicles, but they certainly can't run them like they are. Aaron, thank you for that live report.